Hi again, welcome back. This is part two of an enormous and fabulous box of happy mail that I was blessed to receive by Miss Gail Fava of Four. So I'm going to keep on going to try to get through all of it the rest of the time. We've got some more of this um, burlap and some cord. Another little piece. Oh, another little rose applique. Love. Um, this looks like curtain material, which is awesome for flower making. Um, oh my gosh, my daughter Kaylee Rose, the Disney princess is going to love that. Look at that Cinderella fabric. The head is adorable. Satin. This is one of my all-time favorite fabrics. Look at that. This is so me. I absolutely love this. The teacups and roses. Ugh. Thank you so much for this, Gail. This is gorgeous. And then this looks like another curtain piece. That is awesome. I love putting these in my, like my vintage lot books, so that is where I am sure these will end up. Oh wow, look at this one. I've never seen one like this before with the colors. Oh my gosh, that's gorgeous. It's really, really soft, like a sagey green and pink and ivory. Isn't that beautiful? Gorgeous. Oh, I'm a lucky girl. This is another um, upholstery fabric that is gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous colors in that. Will make a great journal cover. Oh, this is some quilted fabric, and this looks really kind of Victorian. Look at that with the roses. Oh, I love that. That one's like in the lavender hues. So we've got another piece of fabric that's beautiful. And then this one, I think this is a sample, but oh, I love that. Like a, a damask. And oh my goodness, look at this. It's a gorgeous heart doily. Those are hard to find too, the hearts. And then be still my heart. <laughs> look at the Battenberg. Look at these, like they're almost like a square panel. So there's two of these delicious white ones that I absolutely will be hoarding. Oh, thank you so much, Gail. These are gorgeous to die for. And then if that wasn't enough, look at this. There's like a dozen of these. Are these not the most gorgeous? And like, oh my gosh, you could do so much. I think a couple of these will be going in my bedroom, actually. <laughs> and then I'm thinking the rest will be in some... Uh, vintage lot books. Uh, maybe I will share some. We'll see. It's hard for me to part with Battenberg. I'm not going to lie. But I am bowled over by your generosity, Gail. You certainly did not have to send me all of these, and I, I really appreciate it. I absolutely love them. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, I'm going to show you something um, big before I get to the boho stuff. Um, oh, also this sweet little, it's, it's like a jelly box. Isn't that cool? It's squishy with the cherries on top. That was in the box. And then this amazing, I have to hold it so the top will stay on. This is a jar that Gail embellished. You can see the bottom of it. And it is absolutely gorgeous. And then when you open it, it's like chock full. So I'm going to do this can't even get it all out. Look at all this. It's going to take me a long time to sort through all it. Look at this. Oh my gosh, it keeps going and going. This is like an embellishment jar. Look at that. The little bunny ears. Oh my goodness. Handmade flowers. Gail, this is too much. Little bows. We've got buttons. It's like a whole jar of goodies, embellishments. What an awesome idea to give for a gift. This is a, this would be a really good swap if we could find like plastic jars so you wouldn't have to mail like a, um, you know, glass jar. But look at all these goodies. Awesome. One can never have too many embellishments. Oh, love that. Gail, it was so nice of you. You could have just given me the jar. You just so didn't have to fill it all up with all of these goodies. Oh, look at that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Look at that. Awesome. 
Oh, I love that. Look at the dangles. Watch me not be able to get it all back in now, right? So that was one of the big items that was in this um, box. And I have the perfect place for this to sit in my craft room, which is pink. So you did a great job on that. Thank you, thank you. And then the last bit of things I have to show you um, is boho. But I wanted to say that I think the um, I know that there was a pen inside of here and I believe it was this color pink and um, I peeked in the box before I did this video and I think it has fallen out so Gail it, it's here I apologize that I can't show it it's absolutely gorgeous but it has gotten lost um, so I'm gonna tear apart the craft room to find it where I had your box there was some other boxes so I'm gonna have to look through but if I um, when I find it, I will share a photo of it, but it's absolutely gorgeous, so thank you. They want you to think I forgot. And then, finally, um, she sent some gorgeous pieces that I can use for boho, and she told me that um, this first one that I'm going to show you was a dress that she bought and cut up, and oh, she's brave, because I don't know if I could cut up a dress like this. I probably could, but look at the like she sent me so many pieces look at this gorgeous it's a royal blue um, and silver with sequins um, there's even some beads on some of these pieces but there is like piece after piece after piece of this so cool so this is definitely going to replenish my boho stash some and then look at these these are all little seed beads on here I mean gorgeousness and then this one it's just all the royal blue with the sequins they almost look like like a heart pattern that's cool I mean I feel like this is like half the dress Gail that was so sweet of you look at this one oh that one is like whoo showstopper and then we've got more pieces like this another one like this another one that's the silver sequins I mean this is all off of the same dress that is awesome this is, was a amazing dress that you got to harvest beautiful so we have all of these from this one dress then we have ooh, look at that applique that is gorgeous perfect and then we have this little piece of its velvet with the dangles awesome this I'm I'm not gonna lie <laughs> this might be my favorite thing in the box this and another piece look at this piece of sorry y'all oh my goodness is that not gorgeous it's like a turquoisey greenish but look at the bottom of that I mean that is absolutely gorgeous I mean the amount of stuff on here look at that just stunning I absolutely love it. Oh, I really needed more boho stuff too, more sari and things, so that's awesome. This is another one. I'm oh, drooling. Look at that. I absolutely love this deep burgundy color, and I love kind of the, the teal, the contrast of the teal and the gold. There is beads and sequins and seed beads on here, and it's just gorgeous. I love this sorry but I have a feeling I'm gonna be hoarding some sorries look at this that is super cool it's got like a ribbon on it this is like a satin ribbon along the edge very cool and paisley again which I love and then we have kind of goes with that other deep burgundy one it's the same color but all sequins gorgeous gorgeous and along the same lines in that same color is this um, fringe trim As you can see these kind of go together love that and we have another one um, close in that color scheme too look at that this one's more of like a cranberry but look at those embellishments on there gorgeous gorgeous and then we have last but not least this very colorful mesh like I can't even imagine how they get the little delicate embellishments on this thin piece of 
it's like it's tool actually this really thin piece of tool how do they do that that is amazing so to recap I have been spoiled rotten I got quilt blocks um, <clears throat> a vintage quilt piece boho goodies um, the embellishment jar the bag and the pen Battenberg and fabric samples and oodles and oodles of doilies and a beautiful card um, all from the lovely Gail who's Fava 4 and again I will put her um, link to her channel in the description box below please um, go over and check her out and again Gail thank you so 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 much I, I really really appreciate it more than you know and I um, appreciate you so thank you thank you and I will be back again soon with uh, an interesting tutorial so thanks so much for watching hope you all have a great day bye bye